Okay, in this example, we want to find the limit of the difference quotient using L'Hopital's theorem. Okay. So if you've taken any Calculus 1 course, uh, you should recognize, uh, you should be able to recognize what this limit is. Okay. Um, so basically, it's the limit of the difference quotient, which gives you the derivative of f. Okay. So we're going to show that uh, using L'Hopital's theorem. Okay, so plugging in h equals to 0 is going to give us, so using a direct substitution, we're going to get uh, f of x minus f of x divided by h, and this is going to give us 0 over 0. Okay, so this gives us an indeterminate value, okay, which means that uh, we can go ahead and apply L'Hopital's theorem. Okay, so then we have the limit. So h goes to 0. Um, so we're going to take the derivative of the numerator and the derivative of the denominator. So remember that um, in this case, since the limit depends on h, we want to take the limit, uh, sorry, we want to take the derivative with respect to h, not x. Okay? So this is going to give us f prime of x plus h times the derivative with respect to h of x plus h. Okay? minus the derivative of f. So f is in terms of x, but we're taking the derivative with respect to h, so that means this is treated as, f of x is treated as a constant. So this is going to be 0. Okay, All divided by the derivative of h with respect to h is going to be 1. Okay, So now let's go ahead and simplify this. Okay, So f prime of x plus h Okay, we have that uh, times the derivative. Okay, this part. The derivative of x plus h with respect to h is just 1. And then minus 0. Okay, and then divide by 1. So now, okay, so this is just the limit. So h goes to 0 of f prime of x plus h. So plugging in h equal to 0 gives us f prime of x. So therefore, we show that the limit of f of x plus h minus f of x divided by h as h goes to 0 uh, is indeed f prime of x.